what is up guys and girls i am mr e from nyc and if you are new to the channel i want to welcome you right now i'm visiting the boys over at powerful lithium and they are on a roll you have a super 73 malibu edition that's being completely overhauled we have another super 73 rx this is uh, the adventure series if i'm not mistaken it's also getting overhauled they also have this bad boy over here i believe this is the aerial rider x class and that one is getting overhauled everything that you see here has uh, upgraded components like uh, motorcycle grade tires in the front and in the rear you're looking at the uh, magura braking systems i believe these are 220 millimeter discs on one two and three models so far and this this bike over here is just gonna completely blow you away what we have here is a what the hell is this thing it's a Fido fr1 let's say <laughs> fr1 so it is a Fido. I, I think the base is from the Fido, but this is its own frame on its on its so this is something that's custom, right? This is definitely a custom. Yes. <laughs> because that swing arm in the back does not look like a Fido's swing arm. Uh, I like all of this in here. This has been reinforced, right? Uh, the joints, this plate over here has been reinforced as well. Nice. Oh, and I see a powerful lithium battery. Uh, and no upgrade would be complete without one of these. So what are we talking? What you have in here? 51 amp hour. 50, it looks like a... Super 73 RX style. Exactly. It's, no way. That is awesome. So your battery fits right in here. Yes. That's awesome. Uh, did they widen this out? Yes. It's a, it's a, a wider, uh, I want to say basket. The whole frame is longer and wider. Okay. And I see a far driver controller. Is this the 680? No, this is the 450. The 450. Yes. All oh, right. So I think this is what I have for uh, for mine. Yes. Uh, did you take it out for a ride yet? Do a little spin. Oh, can we get it like a flyby? Absolutely. Oh, by the way, before you go, who are you? I'm me. <laughs> You're you. This is us. <laughs> All right, I'm chilling here in front of Power Bolivia with Electric Santito on Instagram. All right, so he's got a new ride and we're going to show it off. Oh, oh, and I got to give mention to these guys over here. Yes. Kemimoto, they've been a dream. They've been hooking us up with these stem mounts. Uh, I got hooked up with a, a, a rear rack for one of my bikes and... Mm. Oh, for your bike. <laughs> <laughs> and I have some foot pegs coming, so look out for that. We'll talk about that soon. All right, so give me a flyby. I want to see how fast this thing goes. Did you uh, no, calculate really that? Okay. All right, I'm at New Jersey's Lincoln Park. I'm gonna get Santito to give me a flyby. And then I'm gonna pass the mic over to him so he can break it down. What did he do to put that thing together? All right, he's gonna show me how fast his, uh, his new creation goes. And then he's got the KC hot on his tail. Ah, he was in mode one. What I have here is uh, FR1, which was built coming off the Fido, but they made it bigger, stronger, a little more length to it. I started out with the Fido, reinforced it, but uh, this was already made for that reason to be reinforced and uh, to be able to enjoy it a little bit more without worrying about anything cracking. So right now, I have a 5,000 watt motor using the far drive 72 480 or 450, I believe. Uh, I'm just giving it a little test ride. Feels smooth, comfortable, rocking a Dualtron Thunder seat. Not under a Dutron X seat. Uh, rear suspension is a 215, rocking 14 inch forks. And right now I'm rocking my 51 amp hour RX battery, just for test purposes. Um, I think we can easily fit 60, to 70 amp hour on this bike. First ride, nice and easy. 
It's hot outside. I got Mr. E behind me somewhere. He's on the javelin. There he is. We got the K6 here, the bull. This thing is a beast. <laughs> that, that looks like too much fun. That thing, that thing is incredible. <laughs> you gotta love it. Yo, it, it pulls. This. You going up? Yep. Not bad. Here we are. We're rolling through some construction here. On our way home from PL. Still testing out the FR1. The mystery. On the javelin. That looks quite sleek, actually. Been going back and forth. I really like just the raw look of the frame. I don't know if I want to paint it. Uh, Mr. E recommended getting it clear coated, which I probably will eventually. But uh, what do you guys think? What color should I go? I had the Fido in blue, which was a nice, it was a nice blue. But I really like this uh, raw kind of, um, you know, custom built look. Not fancy spancy, just raw. All right, I don't know if you talked about the finish of the bike. Did you talk about yeah, it? Yeah, I did, I did. All right, did you ask people what they thought? Yeah, you think I think it would be clear coated? I know you recommended having it clear coated. Uh-huh. So. Yeah, I, I don't know. I like the raw finish, but I would like it to shine a little. Uh, I'm sure you can polish it, right? And get it to, to shine a little bit Probably. more. Probably. But But the raw finish is really, really nice. That's something that I wanted to do. Um, oh, oh, how does she ride? Most importantly, so how far, does she ride? I, I can't, it's smooth, nice, comfortable. I, I just got to get my pegs, uh -huh. they're on the way. But uh, other than that, it's a smooth, nice power delivered smoothly. Did you talk about the tune before? No, we haven't tuned it yet. I'm gonna take it uh, to B and have him give it his touch. A better, a yeah. better tune, okay? So, right now, there's no danger of the wheel popping out when you hit the, the throttle hard, no, right? No, no, no. Okay, not like that, just smooth. It's, it's, smooth. it's a lot like this then, this is really smooth. Yeah. All right, so there you have it. Never a dull moment at Powerful Lithium. I am out of time, I'm on my way home. If you guys have an e-bike and want to do something to upgrade it, don't hesitate and reach out to them. And of course, if you enjoyed this video, don't hesitate, smash the like button. Leave a comment, because I get back to everybody. And if you want to, please subscribe. So until the next video, peace out everybody. Obi, what's up my brother? What's up What brother? the hell happened to your helmet? Did you fall? Aftermath of the Zeus ride, bro. One of the Zeus bikes fell on top of mine. Oh my God. Shit happens. Oh, no. oh man. So a bike fell on yours. Yeah, while we were parked up. How's the frame? I've seen a lot of frames on Facebook saying that they're cracking. The what do you been, think about that? The frame's been holding up well. From what I understand, I've only tracked 14 cases so far, and there's been over 5,000 of these bikes sold. That's less than a 1% defect rate. You know what I mean? That's good to hear. Happen, but the company is doing the best they can to make up for it. They've been sending frames out to people. You know, they offer to send me a frame, and my frame hasn't cracked. You know what I mean? So really, that's, they did that's, you like that? Yeah, bro. That's good customer. And it's service. not just me; it's a bunch of different people. I've been getting frames sent out before damages have even occurred. Get out of here! You that's awesome. I mean? yeah. That's, that's a great. Yeah. That's a, that's a six hundred dollar frame right there that we're getting sent out for free. You know what I mean? So 
I really respect Melvin. I respect Boro for taking the initiative to, you know, do something for the community. That's and right. Not, not even waiting that until it well. happens. That's what I'm saying. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. that's good. Uh, good company to stand by. All right, 100%. well, I'm glad you're okay. For sure. <laughs> I'm glad you're okay. I'm glad your bike's okay. Yeah, no accidents while we were riding. Just, you know, wind tipped over a bike, bike fell on mine. Shit happened. Will I see you on Saturday? 100%, bro. You know we're going to have to pull up. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's what's up. Follow for lithium ride, 713. If you don't know, now you know. Be there.